happy story time. Underground Quest. In a world beneath the ground were two best friends, Hank the Snail and Marilyn the Slug. It was a chilly winter day with the cozy earth around them covered in soft white snow. Hank was a curious snail with a shell as shiny as the moon. He loved exploring and always had a twinkle in his eye. On the other hand, Marilyn was a little shy, but incredibly clever. Her slimy trail sparkled like diamonds in the winter sunlight. One morning, as the underground world shimmered with frost, Hank poked his head out of his cozy shell and exclaimed, Marilyn, wake up, I have an idea. Marilyn stretched her soft body and yawned, curious about what he was up to. Let's go on an adventure, Hank said, his eyes shining like stars. But it's so cold outside, Marilyn replied, looking worried. Don't worry, Hank grinned. We'll bundle up and explore the tunnels under the snow. And with their warmest scarves made of leaves and acorn hats on their heads, Hank and Marilyn set off. They crawled through the tunnels, their excitement growing with every twist and turn. As they ventured further, they discovered a magical world. Icicles hung like sparkling chandeliers from the tunnel ceilings and the walls shimmered with a silvery glow. The air smelled of earth and snow, and their little feet echoed through the tunnels. They met new friends along the way. A beetle who liked to collect shiny pebbles, and an earthworm the talented singer. Together, they laughed, sang, and played games. The underground world was alive with joy and friendship. But suddenly, a strong gust of wind blew through the tunnels, causing the walls to tremble. Oh no, it's an avalanche, Hank shouted. Everyone panicked, not knowing what to do. Marilyn's clever mind kicked into action. Quick, follow me, she yelled. Marilyn led them to a hidden chamber where they huddled together. We need to stay calm she said, her voice soothing like a lullaby. They waited as the ground shook, and soon the avalanche passed. The friends emerged from the chamber, their hearts still racing. As they headed home, Hank looked at Marilyn with admiration. You saved us with your quick thinking, he said. Marilyn blushed and smiled. Well, you inspired the adventure in the first place. Back in their snug homes, 
Hank and Marilyn curled up, tired but happy, realizing even in the coldest of winters, warmth is found in the company of friends. In the winter underground, Hank and Marilyn's friendship grew. They knew that no matter the challenges, they had each other in a world of wonder waiting beneath the snow. And with the dreams of future adventures, they closed their eyes, ready to drift off to sleep, knowing that the underground world held endless magic, just waiting for them to discover. The end. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe.